Uh, this is Pete Team Aldi here at MMH, uh, middle of his video, and I'm meeting here with Riders Creed. Who Hi. else? Yo. Oh, it's great. Guys, I'll this off by saying a few things if you don't mind. One, some people, some adults, some people in life, within the space of eight days, may go to the cinema twice, may even see a band. You guys managed in eight days to play Rambler Man and Steelhouse. Yeah. <laughs> How did that feel? Incredible. <laughs> yeah, really, really good. Yeah, yeah. No, I saw, I was at Man. You guys absolutely smashed it. Thank you. I've genuinely said it before. The reviews of Steelhouse were immense. Yeah. yeah. So, you guys, that must have been pretty an awesome. Yeah. Like, eight days of just... Yeah, it was great. It, it, it got us kind of into that feeling where it's like, this is what we want to do forever sort yeah. of thing. Every weekend we want to be playing another big festival, we want to be playing another big and show. And so we should be, right? Yeah, yeah well, yeah, yeah, that's, yeah, that's yeah, the plan. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. fine. I noticed that Rambo Man was good because I forgot for a minute you were right this week. And I forgot... <laughs> no, no, I mean, it's nice. So at one point, when you, you jumped up, I don't know how you managed it, because I know you're, 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 you're flying up and down the guitar, <laughs> well, and I, as a comp player, I thought, oh god, okay, well, a lot of bands, I'm going to have to go on stage, and I'm going to have to kind of cover it for two or three minutes, but I forgot. I've got this. But do you know what I love? It was amazing, I was just saying before, that not only that looked so natural, and it did, it was brilliant, and you know, it was, behind the scenes there was a guitar and three or four people looking really hectic, yeah, yeah, and you guys yeah. just looked calm and looked cool, and I just thought, everybody who saw me, there's hundreds, literally hundreds of people at Ramblin' Man, you know who you are, Say to me before, who would check out? And I would say, check out my display. And so many people were saying, mate, you were right. You were right. Uh, and yeah. they, were, they were looking for me to tell me that. So well done. Thank and you. I know Steelhouse, like I said, you smashed it. And that's brilliant. So, Because you, you, you look like, to me, you, you sound great, but you look like a package. I mean, you, you look like a rock star. <laughs> you look like a model. You look like a <laughs> <you look> <laughs> No, 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 you look like a hipster barber, you look like <laughs> you look some Oasis tribute band. And you look like, I know, and this is a compliment, right? You look like, do you remember the TV show Big Chef, Little Chef? Oh. Uh, <laughs> you look like a little, Big Little Chef, that's a compliment, right? Kind of like guy and eat spoons. You've got that image, and that's what, you, you don't ask for delivery, you just quite cool guys, right? That's the way, you've not sat around and made up an image, I hope. No, no, the, no, the heart and the hair comes off soon. <laughs> Finish the interview now, Pete. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> really, so, obviously, first album is fantastic. We know that. I'm not going to say that. You know that's all cool. Really upbeat, really just brilliant. Second album, any news on that? Um, so, well, we're obviously working on the second album. We've, we've put that out publicly. Um, we are taking the concept and the idea that we had when we were writing the first album, and we are upping that into what we're capable of doing now. Especially so, what we want to do is, yeah. like any second album, like any band, I want to do better than my first album. Yeah. So well, it's going to be easy, like, you it's, 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 it's always yeah. going to be a challenging thing about what the first album is like anyway, because you, you try and put your best stuff out there on your first album, and, and then you think, oh shit, you've got to do the second album now, and that's got to be even better. Yeah. So we're looking at the formula of the first album, and like, so what works so great about that? Trying to keep some of that in there as well, but also trying to, to push forward and uh, a little bit more um, proggy um, ish, yeah, sort of yeah. a little bit more uh, like a rock and roll proggy kind of thing. Well, storytelling, maybe in there. Not so much so conceptual, it's more, oh, more, more, more music oh, wow. yeah, with the music. I like so that. that. Yeah. Yeah. Music more complex. Yeah, we're trying to get more complex and just like show that there's improvement as, as, as musicians from album one to album two. I love the fact that you say we're going to go more complex. And it appears to be the only person who doesn't know you're doing that is a drummer. He's looking a little bit scared. You can tell me this. It's doing all right, it's keeping them so far. <laughs> so, <laughs> no, because like, one thing you've got, and you're not lucky, you work hard on this, so not lucky at all, but when you listen to an album, to me, and I'm sure a lot of you guys are out there, you listen to an album, you see a band live. If they're not as good as on the album, you don't like the album as yeah, much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys, I love your album, first album, but when you see you live, when you see the characters, then you go back to the album, you go, oh my god, it's a different level. Yeah, Do you yeah, know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I guess the second album, you've got that already, you've got the, the bond. Yeah, and to yeah. me, you, you know, on a stage, you look like a real family up there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah, can yeah, tell, yeah, yeah. you know some bands like Aerosmith and stuff, you know, you don't, you don't get on and they come in. Yeah, and the, yeah, yeah. You can, I can't imagine you guys ever 
It's why he and Adam are ask his agent. No, we've saved that, maybe. No, but you can see you can see on stage, you can see that, you know, when at Ramble Man, when you're flying up in the air, and, and I don't know how you got so high, and you can tell about his legs, mate. His legs. And there are a lot of buddies, you see the race of the band is called. <laughs> it wasn't like that at all. It was, you know, it was great to see. That to me yeah, was, yeah, was yeah. great. Well, when he made the jump, and he actually, and he actually it was made, one hell of a jump. I, I had no idea that he'd even done it. Man. I was at the front of the stage. I did it right. Wait. Yeah. 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 I did the clear too. Good thing with my hands, like and all this, yeah. like, blowing it out, all this. I was like, yeah, yeah, like this is how it's supposed to end. And then, and then I just see this massive. And I just seen him and his guitar's come up and it's like in his hand. Like, I didn't notice anything about this track. And you guys didn't see this, but I ran backstage and honestly it was like Hungry City. There was people around the guitar. <laughs> <laughs> Quick, medic! <laughs> meanwhile, and meanwhile the audience, and I have to say, the people who weren't there, the audience, there was thousands of them. It was so natural, they carried on, they loved it. No one yeah, didn't lose yeah. one member of that audience, which is saying to me as a band. Yeah. It really is. Yeah. No, it is really, really the professionalism, good. that's great. So, oh, no, that's great. Yeah. Uh, last question I'm going to ask you. Uh, obviously, today's a very special day, as we know, because football season has now started. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. I, I feel bad. I was in interview in Western Road. Oh, so you met me here at five, but I had to be honest and say, football, I forgot football was on. So, I left house at five. Uh, you guys football fans? Well, no, I, like, I, like, I like playing, I like playing it, less so than, than watching it. You've got but, I mean, a couple of my mates are football fans and I, I go to yeah. sports bars and watch the games. So. See, I yeah. like watching men watch football and talk about it on TV more than watch it. Yeah, 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 you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, I like yeah, that more. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I know. So on Saturday we've got football. Who you guys? Have you guys come along? Oh yeah, yeah. What's well, the next Sunday? Sunday. Sunday and it's going to be walking with football. So if you want yeah, to see man. your favourite band in the world <laughs> with the with the short song. Come on. That. I might just rip these off from the bar and go on. No, you've lost ten of these members. Richard might still turn up in skinny jeans. Who knows? And then the jacket. He's got the jacket. He's got the sweatshirt. Yeah. I'm looking forward to see you guys there. That'd be great. And uh, more, more than that, I'm very much looking forward. Genuinely, as we know, because we are fans of the band and we would be coming here anyway. As you know that. Looking forward to see you set tonight. New songs in the set. One or two songs. One or two. Okay, brilliant. Well, guys, we're gonna let you go because I know you're on stage soon. Yeah. So you guys will smash it again. You always do. I don't think I've ever not seen you like this queen. Absolutely melt face. And you know that. Yes. You're, you're professionals. Yeah. Yeah. So guys, thank you so much. I'll see you soon. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, guys.